Agro Suede and welcome everyone to Agro Suede Back in Garden with me, Michel Jun Suede. I know it's been a while since you guys last saw me, since I last did a video in regards to the Back in Garden or Back in Gardening. However, there's a justifiable reason why this is the case. Um, in this video, I'm mainly going to do something that needs to be done where I need to basically transplant an aloe vera plant, which, the title said, I grew it in a napkin. So I basically planted an aloe vera plant in a napkin, well in pieces of a napkin, and then I grew it in a cover of a tan bottle. Then after it started to develop roots, roots I then took an egg tray, that is the um, compressed paper egg tray. I break up the bits and I created like some sort of soil um, material with that so that the plant could grow out even better. So what we're going to do right now, I'm going to actually transplant it for you guys. So now I'm going to remove, just so that you can understand, I'm gonna remove the foil first, so that you can see what I used. Okay, so I apologize. This one is not the cover of the tank bottle, but it's the bottom of the tank bottle. The potato was growing in the cover of the tank bottle, okay? So this is, I cut off the bottom of the tank bottle, wrapped it in foil. The foil is very hard. Yeah, I did this just for you guys to see. Alright? So here it is. Let's see the root system, what this looks like. There we go. I will take a picture and put it on Instagram. Oh, okay, so it's the foil is coming up. Ooh, wow. Nice and clean. As you can see here, I've got like cardboard at the bottom and the foil was wrapped around the base of the um, container. But here's the root system. I think it deserves to go into the soil. So here's the foil. So here's the root system, holding on here to the to the bit. Just wanna show you. You can see some part of the screen right there, you can see. Um, but some part of it have been dying because it's needing space to grow out. Um, but yeah, so let's just see if I can break it up so you could see the better root system. Okay, here you go. What's holding on here is the root system. I'm just gonna chop this. I'll clean it, don't worry. Um yes, but this is the root system holding on here to the cardboard pieces. So, so far it looked like the, the aloe vera plant felt better with the cardboard piece than with the compact um, egg tray. That's the material of the compact egg tray. So it was dying with the material from the compact egg tray, it seems. And it held on mainly to the napkin, which is here. This is the napkin right here, the white one, and the brown paper bag, okay? So we are going to transplant it right now. Let's get a closer look as I have this transplanted. Now there is something solid all around it here. Yeah? One, this is one, this, and here's one, here's one. Um, this is old potato. I basically had this in there to decompose. Okay, 
Okay guys, so here we have it, the transplanted aloe vera plant in a pot. I will give you guys an update in like a couple to a few months from now. Um, yes, but in the meantime, I hope that you enjoyed this video and that it gives you the idea while you're home doing nothing to start planting. Um, I want to tell you to start back at the garden, but we are really encouraging persons to stay indoors. Perhaps after this is all over, you can start back at the garden. After COVID-19 is over, um, you can start the backyard garden. If it is that you have your own personal garden, go ahead and of course start the backyard garden. If you are in an apartment complex and you have a shed, you are sharing a lot left with other persons, please stay indoors. You need to keep away from each other in the meantime. Um, but if you are in your personal space, start your backyard garden. Make good use of your quarantine or lockdown time. Okay? Thank you so much. Thank you. 